what the objectives? I guess so. Yeah. Uh, my speech will be three, five to seven minutes. Okay. When a man loves a woman, he would trade the world for the good thing he has found. That's my way of saying hello to you, Toastmasters and guests, Eugenia. Okay. The topic of my speech today is singing is amazing. Singing is amazing. Many people love to sing, but do you know singing have has many important benefits, uh, benefits. In fact, there are so many benefits, you cannot count them all. I put them into three basic categories. The number one is physical benefits. Number two is mental and emotional benefits. Number three is social benefits. First of all, uh, physical benefits. Singing can actually boost your immune system. University of Frankfurt has done a research. They separate a group of choir members into two subgroups. One group, they have them done a rehearsal of one of the songs by, Beethoven, uh, by Mozart for one hour. And they have done the blood test before and after. They actually found out the antibody in your bloodstream has significantly increased after one hour of rehearsal. The other comparison group does not experience the same kind of increase of antibody. Even though they sit in the same room, but they have not sing, they just passively listen to the music. Number two is singing actually will, it's a workout, it improves your lung capacity. And because your face moves and your uh, lung actually has a good exercise for your lung. So you actually you have a stronger body diaphragm for yourself and you will have a better posture. Because when you sing, you stand up straight and you expand your uh, lung capacity and you put back your shoulder and align your back, you will form a good habit and form a good posture. Singing also can help you to improve your sleep. Some people have a problem of snoring when they sleep and have sleep apnea. You know, which they stop breathing every now, at every 30 seconds or so. So because you, when you sing, you improve your throat muscle, and also you improve your uh, muscle inside your mouth. So because of that, you actually can reduce snoring and also reduce the chance of sleep apnea. That's very significant. Second of all, singing has many mental and emotional benefits. Singing actually can help you release uh, brain chemical, it's called endorphins, which will make you happy. And research also have found inside our ear, there's a tiny organ called saccharis. If you sing, you generate some kind of frequency that will make the organ happy immediately, no matter what song you sing. So singing can bring happiness to you. By singing, also you, uh, you will, singing will also help to decrease uh, stress hormone inside your blood. It's called cortisol. So that's a lot of mental and emotional benefits. Singing can also, because when you sing, you improve your overall blood circulation and you bring more oxygen to your brain. So what happens is, and you will have better mental alertness, better concentration, and you will have better memory. In fact, the Alzheimer's Society have developed a program called Singing for the Brain to help people with dementia and Alzheimer's to maintain their memory. It's so important. Last but not least, singing can also improve your social skills and has many social benefits. For example, when you sing, you typically go to a karaoke party or you go to a choir, you have a lot of chance to interact with people. You will make new friends, you will, have a, you will build a better bond with your friends, the old friends. Singing can also... Uh, singing can also really help you uh, 
have a better understanding of other people's uh, ability. When you try to do something, you know how high it is, you will be better understand the singing skill of some famous singers. You may even start to learn how to appreciate a new kind of music you never uh, interested before. With all these great benefits, so what are you waiting for? We should all start to practice singing, join a karaoke club, go to some karaoke party, or join a choir, you know? So again, singing is amazing. And singing can bring joyful feeling to you. And let me, uh, you don't have to become a first class singer. You just need to start to sing and enjoy doing it and have a good time. Let me end my speech with a few lines with one of my favorite songs. Oh my love, my darling, I have hunger for your touch a long, lonely time and time goes by so slowly and time can do so much are you still Thank you very much. <laughs>